All right, everyone, welcome back to a new customization video. Today, we got the new car from the Drug Wars Part 2 update, the Willard Eudora. You can purchase it from Southern San Andreas Super Sports for $1.25 million. Don't really know what it's based off. Probably a 60s Chevy or something. Uh, I'm just excited to get right into it, though. I'm a little disappointed. This is the only new car I've seen so far from the Drug Wars update. I was expecting a little bit more. Let's see what this guy has to offer. We start off with some arch covers. All right. Chrome, non, secondary. Mm. No, we're, let's definitely not, we're not doing chrome. I think we'll do like how the secondary goes with the bottom part of the body. Armor, upgrade that. And the brakes, bumpers, primary stock, secondary, chrome classic, low rider, and some painted lowrider. Okay, I definitely like this one the most. Yeah, I think we'll do secondary for that too, just to keep the same theme going. For the rear bumpers, we got a stock rear bumper and the chrome classic bumper. What is this one? Vintage spare wheel, that's kind of cool. Classic bumper with spare. Eh, okay. Kind of a lot going on. I'm not a huge fan of the spare wheel. I think, I think we'll do this one. I like the vintage one. I don't know if I like chrome though. That doesn't match with the front one. Ah, uh, why not? Let's just do the vintage with the spare. And we'll upgrade the engine. Exhaust. At the back here. Ooh, we got some double ones. Side exit ones with triple ones. Okay. Small dual side exit. Another large one and a double one. I think. I kind of like that triple one. But it's a little aggressive. I think we'll do double chrome ones. That looks pretty awesome. For the grill, got some painted stock one, 70s classic, horizontal block, primary vertical, secondary chrome, aggressive, and that's it. Okay. I kind of like the look of the stock ones. It kind of fits with how the taillights look too a bit. Those pointy bits. I'm not a fan of the vertical bars. Yeah, the aggressive one looks pretty cool though. Let's do that one. Onto the hood. Primary vented, ribbed one. Oh, that's stylish. Chrome trim, vented one. Ooh, I like this one. Center trim. Yeah, let's do one of those. I like those vents back there too. No horn. We'll upgrade the lights. And ooh, onto a livery. Got a pinstripe that's blue. Ooh, if we did that, we might have to change the hood. And some thick white striping. Can't really see that, but it goes up here. A little bit around. Outline white. Oh, that's kind of cool. Outline. Oh, that's even cooler. I kind of like that a lot. White flame. Red flame. Orange thing. Ooh, green thing. Classic blue pinstripes. Green. A cab. Stunt jumps during taxi work. Okay. Interesting. Uh, I think I like these red pinstripes. Absolutely. Onto the mirrors. Got some squared ones, rounded ones, classics. Chrome Vintage, that comes on the top there. I do like these classic ones. Actually, the rounded ones. Those look a bit better. Plate, ah, uh, can barely even see it. It's just under there. I will leave that. Respray, here we go. So primary is on top. I think I like the white there. Secondary, that's down here. What does it look like with all white? That's kind of cool. Very clean. I don't know, what kind of colors did old cars have? They were kind of bright. I think I'm like maybe a pale blue, a light blue, or a silver. I think a bright silver or something. Red looks really nice too. Bluish. Yeah, let's do bluish. And then the primary could maybe also be bluish. Okay, that looks pretty neat. I think I might change the livery though. Trim color. I can make this red uh, for now to match that livery. And also red interiors always look super cool. Secondary roof, that's it for that. We got the roof racks, some luggage, and a surfboard. I don't know if I want luggage on my car all the time. Surfboard's kind of cool though, we'll do that. Sunshades. And no. Oh, the windshield goes way up to the top there, that's kind of cool. Suspension. Oh, that looks awesome lowered, absolutely. Transit up. Trim. Chrome trim, primary. Chrome trim plate. I don't know if I like that. I don't. I can't really tell what that looks like. We're gonna leave that off, I think. We'll put the turbo on. Wheels. I think I'd have to get lowrider wheels for the white walls like that. 
That's kind of cool. I barely go in this section. Stock tires do look good though. Let's get let's get these ones on. That looks nice. And maybe we'll leave it like that. Design custom. Oh yeah, that's cool. Color. What color should we do the wheels of? Actually, it kind of goes with the rim, so maybe we'll leave that off. Uh oh yeah, we have to bulletproof it. Like it really matters. Windows. Tints that all the way around. Don't really like how it's super dark. We'll do a light smoke there. And that's about it. Let's do. I'm just gonna change the livery one more time. Oh, I think the orange is pretty cool, actually. Yeah, I kind of like the orange. I think it, it's a bit more retro. Fits the style of the car a little bit, a little bit more. But maybe we'll respray it again. I bet this would look really cool in black. Definitely does, but I think I want it to be a little bit brighter. Oh, you know what? I'm happy with it as gray. Might change it later. Let's just take it outside, though. Unfortunately, your friend escaped. Oh, yeah, this is a little bug. Don't even worry about this. It's just a Rockstar security thing where if someone can get into it, they can just send messages and it doesn't require any authentication. So it's completely safe. Don't worry about it. But here's a new car. Ah, uh, little sound test. Uh, I don't know. No, sounds like a car. Oh, big wheelie, though. Okay. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh! Actually, I need to turn down my message frequency because that'll set it off quite often. Notifications, metrics, frequency, one hour. So you can do that to kind of stop it. Back to the review. It feels like a regular old car. Nothing too crazy about it. It's got some cool customization though. It's kind of like a retro surfer car. I bet it would look pretty cool in some beach browns or something. Like a beach car. Maybe I should have done like a bright blue or something. Anyway, it's kind of fast I guess oh boy not great handling I don't know nothing too special about it I don't know I mean it's not it's not too expensive 1.2 million dollars for a new car nowadays is kind of the norm and it's got some decent customization it looks pretty cool someone tell me what this car is based off and I'll pin that comment yeah I think that's about it thank you so much for watching leave a like if you enjoyed leave a dislike if you didn't let me know what you think of the build and let me know what you think of the car if you buy one and that's about it I'll see you all later